In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to draw a plant like that with some difficult points like this or here or maybe even here with uh, different thicknesses of the walls. So hit the like button and let's learn, practice and share. Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, Matt Tutorials. Today we're going to get a little bit serious about working with ArchCAD and we want to know how we could use all these elements that we learned so far. So I import this layout from AutoCAD to ArchiCAD. And uh, now I want to start drawing this plan. And uh, the reason that I chose this plan is a, a little bit complexity that it has because of the angle of this wall. And uh, also we have some walls with different width. And I think in general, it's a, it's a very nice plan to start with. Also, we have stairs that I will speak about in further video. So if you would like to know about how to draw stairs uh, in ArchiCAD, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell so you would notify when I release a new tutorial. So I'm going to uh, select the wall tool. And here I'm going to start from this corner. And it seems that this is the hardest part on, of this plan. So I'm going to start with uh, this part. Here we have a, a straight wall. I'm going to um, set the wall to the straight. And uh, I don't need any structure for now. So I'm going to put it on the structure. One important point that I just forgot is I should set the project units. So here on the project reference, uh, on the working units, I'm going to put the units on the meter because I'm more comfortable with meter. Then uh, with two decimals also for the area, volumes, degrees, and the layout, of course, meter and two uh, decimals. I'm going to hit OK. And uh, now I can work with uh, any tool. I'm going to start with this point by clicking here. And as you see, here our first problem. So I want to draw the wall on this side, but uh, the wall seems to be on the other side. I can fix it just by clicking on this button here and the wall will be turned on the other way. The next problem that we have is the thickness of the wall. So uh, I can set different thickness. So maybe 30. Let's try. Yeah, 30 seems fine. And if I start from here, uh, the wall seems fine until we get here. So we, we have some um, wall with uh, more uh, thickness. So uh, I'm going to keep the shift key down while I'm on, the, on this line. I'm going to um, keep the shift down and I can click on this point. And now I have the first wall. Then I have the wall with a little bit uh, more uh, thickness. So I'm going to put it on 50 maybe or maybe 60. Of course, we can do this uh, after we draw the wall. So for now, I think 60 is fine. I'm going to hold down the shift key and then click and then I'm going to put it back to 30. And then I'm going to continue till this point. And 30 seems uh, a little bit thin for us. 40. 40 seems fine. So I'm going to click it like that. Then I would like to fix this part here. With the M key on the keyboard, I can have the measure tool. Uh, so I can click from this point to this point And uh, the distance is uh, 0.04 uh, meter. I can add this amount to this wall by selecting it. And here I can add just this four right here and the wall will be fixed. Also for here, it's three centimeters. So I'm going to add three centimeter here. It seems fine. Okay. Then we have something like this. So what should I do with this now? If you remember what I explained on the 
wall tool, we have a geometry method named polygonal. So by clicking on that, I don't need to put in the thickness anymore. Uh, I can start drawing the shape that I have uh, from any point. So for example, here, then we have some difficulties here. So I'm going to click here. This, wall, this part is straight. I'm going to click. And I'm going to draw it like that. OK, as you see, these two walls uh, are connected very neat together. So I'm going to continue with this wall and I'm going to fast forward until I got to a point that I need to explain. draw all the exterior walls and uh, I draw also on the windows uh, because you must have walls while you want to use the window tool in ARCHICAD. So uh, we have a little bit problem here so I'm gonna also fix uh, this part. I think it's just this one but before I'm gonna draw this interior wall here so I'm going to put it on the 10 centimeter of thickness. Then I'm going to change this and like that. OK. Now I can split this wall from uh, this part by uh, using the split tool. And if you don't know how to use uh, the split tool or trim or these tools here, uh, click on the card right up here and uh, watch that video. And if you like it, don't forget to like that video. So I'm going to split uh, this wall from this wall. So I'm going to click it like that. And then here, I'm going to put uh, this wall on uh, the trapezoid. And I'm going to set a different number for this part. Maybe more. Yeah, it seems fine. Also, I'm going to do the same for uh, this wall. So 32. Yeah, it seems fine. Now uh, we have problem here. So I'm going to fix that part too. the exterior walls and now I want to uh, draw the interior walls and uh, also I fixed all the problems that these exterior walls had. So I'm going to continue uh, by these two um, interior walls that I just drew. I'm going to drag it to this part and also this one to here. Then I'm going to uh, copy all the settings of this wall and I'm going to start drawing from here.
there you go. I just draw all the walls on this uh, plan, which it, it was not a modern and very straight uh, plan. Uh, so for example, here on these uh, points, uh, you saw that how did I control the walls and how did I manage to uh, draw this plan? So this is it for today. Uh, don't forget to like this video if this video was useful for you. And if this is the first time that you're watching my tutorials, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And on the next tutorial, uh, I'm going to talk about how to draw windows and doors for uh, this plan. And of course, some uh, more information and settings to working with Archicad. See you on the next video. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.